Good morning, boys and girls. Happy Sunday. Today in our Bible lesson, we're going to learn about somebody who wins and somebody who loses. Now, what does it mean to win? Have you ever won something before? Have you said, hey, I'll race you, and whoever gets to the other side of the room first wins? That's a race, and the person who got there first won, right? Well, let's see in our story who wins. There's two people. Well, there's God, and there's somebody else, and his name is Pharaoh. Let's see who wins. All right. Our story today comes from the book of Exodus. Exodus is in the Old Testament. It's the second book of the Bible. It tells the story of Moses and all the people that belong to God. Look at all of these people. These people right here look sad. They want to go away from these people. These people are kind of mean. They're angry. But even though these people want to go away, this man, this man won't let them. This man is Pharaoh. God knows about his people. And God knows about Pharaoh. We want to go away, the people said. No, 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 said Pharaoh. God help us. Please help us, the people said. Will God hear them? Do you think God will help them? Yes, God did hear them. God did help them. God is big and strong. God took them away from the people, from the people that were mean. God's people got to go away. They packed up their stuff and they hurried away. The bad man said as they were running away, no, no, no. But God said, yes, yes, yes. The man had to let the people go. God always wins. Did the people want to go away? They did, didn't they? But what did the man say to them? What did, what did Pharaoh say to the people who wanted to go away? They, he said, no, he wanted them to stay. But what did God do? Did God save his people? Yes, God saved his people because God is big and strong and mighty. You know, there's a song about that. You want to sing it with me? Sing along if you know the words. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. The mountains are big, the rivers are big, the stars in the skies are big too. But God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. Great job. All right, let's pray together. Will you bow your head and close your, close your eyes, fold your hands? We're going to talk to God right now. Dear God, thank you for being so big and for helping your people go away when they wanted to go away from Pharaoh. Thank you for being faithful to them and for loving them. God, thank you for being faithful to us and loving us. God, we know because of the stories in your Bible and because of your faithfulness that you are loving to us and that you always win. You always take care of your people. So we know that you will always take care of us. Lord, we praise you for who you are, and we thank you for your wonderful stories and your wonderful deeds. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, boys and girls, I'll see you in church later. Bye.